There's a new sporting rivalry between Australia and England, a supersonic race for the world land speed record. It's a race between a Royal Air Force fighter pilot with big financial backing and a knockabout Aussie who's building a rocket car in his garage. Howard Gretton reports. This man is the world's fastest on land. He's a fighter pilot too, RAF Wing Commander Andy Green. In this car, he hit 1,200 kilometres an hour in 1997. Now he's chasing 1,600 k's, the magical land speed mark of 1,000 miles an hour. He's building a new supercar, a computer dream at the moment. Bloodhound SSC, you're cleared. Engine start. The Bloodhound supersonic car, powered by a jet engine and a rocket. The Bloodhound SSC, we're looking at, from a standing start, the car is going to be 16 kilometres away in 100 seconds. On the other side of the world, Australia's fastest man chasing the same high-speed dream. The English team is high-tech and high-finance. Now let me show you the Australian headquarters. It's a garage in the northern suburbs of Perth, the home of Roscoe McGlashan. McGlashan is building his Aussie Invader rocket car with a shoestring budget and a volunteer workforce. The thing about this is it's, it's pure rocket. It's, it's the world's most powerful car, 200,000 horsepower, and it makes full power in five milliseconds. Roscoe McGlashan became the fastest Aussie on Earth when he clocked 802 kilometres an hour on a South Australian salt lake. That was back in 1994. Now cameras were there. He hit 1,000 k's once, but it was never official. This is the ultimate ashes competition for, uh, for the land speed record. The car is designed to go from a standing start to 1,600 kilometres an hour in 20 seconds. Not an actual race, but they're hoping to get their rocket cars together when they go for the record. Rivalry and respect. Australia, come on, get behind your boy, help Roscoe to build that car. And Roscoe, mate, we'll see you out in the salt. Let's go fast. It's uh, just something that I'd like to achieve for Australia. Howard Gretton, 7 News. Go Roscoe.